Hey, Dr. Brett here. First thing in the morning on Sunday, we're walking the dogs, Jupiter, and our mean my friend Shepard. Pretty cool stuff. They're both tied to my waist because it makes everything easier. It's a great way to train a dog. You tie the dog to your waist. I got my wife in the background checking out her phone. Tore us up in Thai, if I can pronounce it halfway correctly. Um, we do this so many times a day. These dogs have a great life here. Um, it's just really cool to live on the inlet. Oh, we got a neighbor over here who's 80 something years old. She's lovely. Um, it's a pretty good life, but you got, but always um, doing the fundamentals, right? Got up, swam briefly, and um, I'm gonna do some breath work, and then I'm gonna talk to some people talk to some clients, whatever, call some friends, watch a bunch of football. I'm really excited for the NFL. Holy cow, we got the fall coming. You got baseball, like playoffs in October. You got the NFL going. And then these tennis matches, the US Open, the final, Djokovic is playing for the for the career Grand Slam here. I kind of like crazy stuff if he wins, but I'm rooting for Ned the Dev, even though he's a Russian, I just, um, you know, I just think he's like a cool guy with a lot of personality. And as much as I like, you know, Djokovic's play, I don't know, he's too much of a machine for me. Um, Leila Fernandez lost um, to Emma Raducanu in the women's final yesterday. And um, I was rooting for Leila. She's got so much personality and style, 19 years old, but it was great to see an 18 year old who had to qualify for the US Open to actually make it and to win it all. I mean, I, something like that just hasn't been done in forever. Um, I can't remember the last time. I, I've never seen that in my lifetime. So pretty special stuff. Layla, as much uh, talent as she has and as much style and tenacity and competitiveness. I mean, it was just incredible. Um, she just has real grace. Um, you know, she's able to sort of acknowledge New York in her interview, but there was a feistiness to her. She just wants to be back. She wants to win. I think she got a little nervous. Her first serve was off and she double faulted a bunch, which she didn't do in her previous matches as she took out all these top players in the world. She definitely had a much more difficult draw. Um, and maybe she ran out of gas a little bit as well. Um, but that woman will be back, 19 year old girl that will be back. And congratulations to Emma Raducanu, which is um, sports paradise. I'm gonna get a lot of exercise in because I can't just watch TV without having burnt out my system a little bit and doing a little bit of breath work like I always do, which is a pretty amazing way to live. All the athletes I train um, and help on their life's journeys, we try to hit the fundamentals, stuff I talk about all the time, right? The meditation, the mindfulness, the visualization, the breath work, and the tough communication, not avoiding. Hey, I'm Dr. Brett, and this is my wife over here, Chana Khan. And we'll be back together, and the dogs are down below. Take care. Hit like and subscribe, and if you really want to support us, sign up to our Patreon.